Podcast from the Avondale Library, and today I would like to share a story with you about two friends, a cat and a dog, and these two friends had a dispute. The story is Cat, Dog, Monkey. Now, once there was a cat and a dog who were very, very good friends. Cat and dog liked to do all kinds of things together, but the thing that they liked to do most was to sit along the side of the road and watch the cars go by. They loved watching the cars go by. Now, on this particular day, as it would happen, a truck came down the road and they saw it from far off and that truck was lurching and it was burping and it was hiccuping all down the road and it came to where it was just about in front of them and then that that truck speeded up a little bit and when it did the back doors of that truck opened up and out fell something onto the ground. Now the truck was long gone and cat and dog ran to see what that something was and they noticed that it was a piece of juicy meat. And cat looked at that meat and said, Wow, mine. And dog looked at it and said, Oh, mine. And cat said, Oh, mine. And dog said, Oh, I saw it first, mine. And cat grabbed one side and dog grabbed the other side and cat went, Oh, mine. And dog said, Oh, mine. Mine, 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 mine. And they pulled and jerked and did all of those things until finally they were exhausted and dropped the meat on the ground. Now, monkey had been watching this entire exchange. So Monkey came up and said, Cat, dog, what's going on? And Cat said, a, a truck came by and dropped meat on the ground and I saw it first and well, it's mine. And dog said, yes, a truck came by and dropped meat on the ground and I saw it and it's mine. And Monkey said, Cat, dog, cat, dog, you are best friends. I cannot stand to see a piece of meat come between you. I will help you out. Monkey said, I will take this piece of meat and I will cut it in half. And Monkey picked up that piece of meat and he went into his pocket and he got out his pocket knife. And I, I have no idea where a monkey got a pocket knife, but or, or a pocket for that matter. And Monkey cut that piece of meat in half. And when he had cut it in half, he put one side in one hand and one piece in the other hand. And he said, so now cat, dog, now look at it. It's even, uh-uh, wait a minute, cat. It's it's actually not evenly cut. I didn't do such a good job cutting. You know what I'm gonna have to do is I'm gonna have to fix that. And cat said, oh yeah, it, would be, it wouldn't be fair. And, and Monkey said, I'm gonna make it fair. I will fix it. I'll just nibble a piece. And he nibbled a piece off of cat's piece of meat and said, okay, so now we're perfect. We're, we're oh dear. Dog, um, looks like your piece is bigger. And dog said, oh, I wouldn't want that. I wouldn't want to cheat cat, she's my friend. And monkey said, I know she's your friend. And I wouldn't want you to cheat her either. So I will fix this for you. I will fix it. I'll just take a little nibble. And he took a nibble off of dog's piece and he said, okay, so now it's per, oh, wait a minute, cat, your piece is bigger again. Um, let me fix that, you know I can fix it, I'll fix it. Okay, so now it's perfect. And dog, oh wait, dog, your piece is big. Oh, the dog, cat, dog, cat, dog, cat, dog, cat, dog. And that monkey ate up all of that meat, every scrap of it. And when he was finished, he raised his hand and said, see ya, and walked away. And cat looked at dog and said, Ow. And dog looked at cat and said, Ooh. Cat said, Ooh. Dog said, Ooh. And dog said, you know something, cat? And cat said, what, dog? And dog said, the next time we have a disagreement, we will settle it for ourselves because we don't want a guy like that to make a monkey out of us.